welcome to another episode of Rod and Brewery. We are in Blueport and Bridgeport, and I'm trying out a flight. And look how big these are. It's crazy. Oh, my producer just decided to get a phone call right in the middle between. That's okay. It's alright. It's not like I'm shooting anything or have anything to do. Alright, so this first one is a Blood Orange IPA. It smells awesome. It smells like a nice, bright summer day, like it is now. It's beautiful. That's so good. I mean, Doopies, it's kind of has like that little bit of a IPA bite afterwards, but it's not so bitter and strong that you're like, Ehh. no, it's refreshing. It's like that little, little punch there, but I like it. And I really like the smell. It smells so good. All right, the next one is Make It So Galaxy IPA. This one's clear. That is smooth as hell. I like it. I definitely think this is like if you're because uh, we had our waitress and she was telling us that she's not an IPA drinker, but she tends to choose this, and that's something that and, and she's and she said that even though she doesn't like it, she loves this. I can see why. So if you're not really much of an IPA drinker, this is your go-to right here. Even I, even I like IPAs, and this is my go-to. So I like it. It definitely tastes great. This is warm. All right. So this is an old news double IPA, and look at the color. It's like an amberish, goldish. I usually smell my beer before I drink it because I like to get that whole experience. Like I feel like I'm like a, you know, in a winery, and I'm like, you know, doing one of these. You would never know that's a double IPA. This, it, it kind of reminds me of a lager a little bit, but not really. If it has that, but I can feel it. I can feel a little hops, but not as strong, but this is this will kick you. I like it. All right, so this one I had trouble pronouncing. It's the Whaley Lager, I hope I said it right. Yeah. Light, crisp, refreshing. That is awesome. That, if I'm at like a game outside or like, you know, just like, because I, I don't play games, I, I'd rather watch people play, and that's a good one to have. So the last one my producer decided to get is this brown ale. Look how freaking amazing that is. so good. I'm impressed. Usually I'm not impressed with brown ales, but that one just surprised the hell out of me. It just said, here I am, and it took me by surprise, and I loved it. So initially, this blood IPA is a 6%. Make it so. Um, I have it here, if I can find it. It's 6%. Double is 8. With the whale is 5. And then the brown... The Imperial Brown is 8.2, that's probably why I like it, it's filled with alcohol. All right, so what I'm gonna give this, and I think this place is awesome, is a B plus. Like, this is very good, delicious, they give you a good sized beer, they serve food, they like the vibe, it's a nice day, hang out. Like, remember to like, follow, subscribe, I'm gonna be doing more videos to annoy you, and to annoy everybody I know. And yeah, definitely come hang out, brought out.